welcome back to our channel jangan lupa klik tombol subscribe dan loncengnya for this meeting we will study about chapter 4 come to my birthday please in this chapter we will learn to invite someone to do something untuk mengundang seseorang melakukan sesuatu The purpose of learning Tujuan pembelajaran 1. Students can know expressions of inviting someone to do something Siswa dapat mengetahui ungkapan mengundang seseorang melakukan sesuatu 2. Student can know expression of accepting and declining an invitation Siswa dapat mengetahui ungkapan menerima dan menolak undangan How do we invite someone to do something? Bagaimana cara kita mengundang seseorang melakukan sesuatu? Now, open your English book and look at the dialogues. Hello, good morning. This is Benny. Oh, hi Benny. Good morning. How are you? Fine. I just got your invitation card to your birthday party. You are coming, aren't you? Yes, I am. Thanks for inviting me. Of course. You are one of my best friend. Don't forget to wear a t-shirt, okay? Are you sure we should wear a t-shirt to your party? Yeah, there will be some outdoor games. Wow, that must be fun. Okay. See you then. Alright, see you soon. Based on the dialogue, which expression of inviting, accepting, and declining. The sentence, you are coming, aren't you? Kamu datang kan? Ini termasuk ungkapan to invite someone atau mengundang seseorang. And, yes, I am. Thanks for inviting me. Ya, terima kasih telah mengundang saya. Ini termasuk ungkapan menerima undangan atau accepting an invitation. And, in this dialogue, dan pada dialog ini, there is no expressions about the declining and invitation. Tidak ada ungkapan menolak undangan. Next dialog. Hello, Benny. This is Edo. How are you? I'm fine. Benny, are you coming to Lena's birthday party? Yes, you are coming too, aren't you? Of course. Let's walk together to her house. Okay. Don't forget to wear a t-shirt. We will play outdoor games there. Really? Okay, I will wear my purple t-shirt. So, we'll just walk to Lena's party, right? Wait for me near the bridge. Okay. We'll meet at 9 there. Be there on time. Don't let me wait too long. Yes, don't forget to have your breakfast before you go. Certainly. See you then. Thanks. Now, we will find the expressions of Inviting, accepting, and declining. Kita akan menemukan ungkapan mengundang, menerima, dan menolak. Let's walk together to her house. Ayo berjalan bersama ke rumahnya. Itu termasuk ungkapan to invite someone to do something. Mengundang seseorang melakukan sesuatu. And wait for me near the bridge. Tunggu saya di dekat jembatan. Itu juga termasuk ungkapan to invite someone to do something. Mengundang seseorang melakukan sesuatu. And, okay. Itu adalah ungkapan accepting an invitation. Menerima undangan. And, in this dialogue, there is no expression about declining an invitation. The expressions of to invite someone to do something. Ungkapan mengundang seseorang melakukan sesuatu. Can you? Bisakah Anda? Will you? Maukah kamu? I'd like you to. Saya ingin Anda. Perhaps you care to. Mungkin Anda berkenan untuk. We should be pleased, delighted, if you could. Kami akan sangat senang jika Anda bisa. Would you like? Maukah kamu? Let's, ayo. Are you coming? Apakah kamu datang? Could you join us? Bisakah kamu ikut kami? Dan masih banyak ungkapan yang lain.
Example, contohnya. Leah will have her birthday party tomorrow. She will invite her friends. She will say, Can you come to my birthday tomorrow? Will you come to my birthday tomorrow? I'd like you to come to my birthday. Perhaps you care to come to my birthday. We should be pleased or delighted if you could come to my birthday. Would you like to come my birthday? Let's come to my birthday party. Are you coming? Could you join us? To respond an invitation. Merespon undangan. Accepting atau menerima. Oke, okay, alright, baiklah. That sounds a nice idea. Kedengarannya ide yang baik. Sure, certainly, tentu. That's really most kind of you. Kamu sungguh baik hati. With pleasure, dengan senang hati. Yes, please. Ya, baiklah. What a splendid idea. Thank you. Ide yang baik. Terima kasih. Yes, I would like to join. Ya, saya akan ikut. Declining, menolak. I regret that I should not be able to accept. Saya menyesal saya tidak bisa menerima. I wish I would. But, saya harap saya bisa. Tetapi, I'm afraid I've already promised to. Maaf, saya sudah berjanji untuk. I'm terrible sorry. I don't think I can. Dengan sangat menyesal, saya tidak bisa. No, thank you. Tidak, terima kasih. Thank you for asking me, but terima kasih telah mengajak saya. Tetapi, thank you very much, but terima kasih banyak. Tetapi, unfortunately, sayangnya. However, thank you. Akan tetapi, terima kasih. What a pity. I couldn't. Sayangnya, saya tidak bisa. Sorry, I can't. Maaf, saya tidak bisa. Let's watch the dialects. Dialect 1. Buddy, are you free this afternoon? Yes, I am. What's up? Could you come to my party this afternoon? What? I'm sorry, Diwa. I didn't know that today is your birthday. Happy birthday, Diwa. Hopefully health, prosperity, and success will be yours in the future. Thank you. So, can you make it? Yes, sure. What time will the party begin? At 4 p.m. Well, see you at the party, buddy. See you. Thanks for inviting me. You're welcome. Dialect 2 Dad, let's go fishing next Sunday morning. We haven't done it for a long time, have we? Thank you for asking me but I feel very exhausted. I just want to stay at home. Come on, Dad. Spending time at home all day during a holiday is boring, you know. I know that but I'm feeling lazy to go anywhere this week. Why don't you invite Burke and Rafa? They would love that. No, I won't. I just want to stay with you, Dad. I want to play with you. Let's play chess then. Sorry, my boy. My job drained my energy this week. I need a break so that I can be fit for Monday. That's okay, Dad. So, please take a rest and enjoy your time. Thanks. Both the dialogues mention expressions about to invite someone to do something. Kedua dialog menyebutkan ungkapan tentang mengundang seseorang melakukan sesuatu. Dialog 1 To invite someone to do something. The sentence, will you come to my party this afternoon? And accepting an invitation. Yes, yeah, sure. Dialog 2 To invite someone to do something. The sentence is, let's go fishing next Sunday morning. Let's play cheese then. And the client invitation. Thank you for asking me, but I feel very excited. Sorry, my boy. The conclusion. Kesimpulan. To invite someone to do something is to ask someone to go somewhere or do something. Mengundang seseorang untuk melakukan sesuatu. Used to invite or to ask someone such as inviting to events, inviting to play and others. Digunakan untuk mengundang atau mengajak seseorang seperti mengajak acara, mengajak bermain, dan lain-lain. 
to respond an invitation such as menanggapi sebuah undangan yaitu accepting an invitation menerima undangan atau ajakan or atau declining an invitation menolak undangan atau ajakan. Okay, I think that's all today. See you.